and I'm going to plan for it. So <laughs> join me, will you? Here's this week's. It's going to look something like this, except with different colors. I'm going to get this little bookmark. Um, so I have no idea what I'm going to do here as far as colors. So that's, that's that. Let's take a look at what washi tape I've got. Um, so if you want disclaimers, uh, I haven't used this one a while. Hmm, maybe. Um, as far as disclaimers, I've been recording videos for Vlogmas sort of haphazardly. Um, and there is a very good chance that they might not make a lot of sense. If I reference something that's in a video that you haven't seen yet, uh, then just know that that video is coming and probably only in a matter of days, so no need to worry. And let's see. See, this three box thing, it's about wide enough for this kind of tape, this dimension of tape. That'd be nice, right? This would be nice. All right, I'll go ahead and use this one. It's a favorite. This is from Simply Gilded. All right. Also, if you can see my head right now, I'm sorry. Okay. And if this video ends up being boring, sue me, I guess. But like I said, I haven't really prepped it at all. I just need to get my week planning done. And I thought that you might be interested in seeing that process. So these are the, uh, the weeklies that I've showed you in, the, oh, that's a terrible tear, the, that I showed you in my Peanuts Planner Co. Haul video. I've been using them for a few weeks. Like I mentioned, I actually got this one sooner than the rest because I was eager to start using them. And I've been using this monthly area, or not monthly, this, you know, hourly area, sorry, <laughs> to track my baby's sleep patterns, but... I'm thinking this week, I've decided that I've learned all I can from that for now. I will probably try that again in another month or two to see if anything has developed. But for now, I think I'm going to track her poopy diapers because if you're interested in this, caution, I'm going to be talking about bodily functions. Uh, we cloth diaper. I've mentioned this. I've shown them. Uh, and when you cloth diaper a newborn, you don't have to do anything to the diapers. Once they're dirty, you just change them. You throw the whole thing in the wash and then the poop comes out, which is good. Oh my goodness. Can you imagine? Um, because newborns poop so much. They pretty much when they're first, just, you know, days old, uh, for those first few weeks, they poop pretty much every single diaper. Uh, that kind of, the uh, timelines are fuzzy already. I think that changes within about a month to six weeks, something like that. Uh, they'll start having more just pee-pee diapers and poop just a few times a day. Some babies only poop every couple of days. Ours has pooped, I think, at least once every day her entire life. Um, so that's fine. But um, when she's older, she's going to need to have... or. When she starts solids, uh, she's going to need to have her diapers sprayed because solid uh, fed poop can't go straight into the wash. I start my tracker here at six um, and end it. Well, we'll see. She, the baby wakes up sometimes sooner than that. But if she wakes up before that, we're not going to like get up and start our day. We just kind of deal with her being silly and punching us in the face uh, and try to get a little bit more sleep. And then her bedtime routine usually starts at seven. Sometimes if we're busy or if she's not tired or something, it'll be a little bit later than that. Um, but yeah, so everything fits on here quite nicely. Monday's the third. See. It's really tricky to fit double digit numbers in these boxes. I'm not sure exactly what they're designed for, but go. Just do purples, I guess, or should I do stars? 
Yes. Yes, maybe. My parents are coming up. And they're going to be spending a night either with us or with our in-laws who live down the street. Um, but in town. Uh, Wednesday evening. Just going to mark this, right? Why not? Wednesday evening through Thursday. And they are probably driving home that night. So I'm just going to put... Here it is. I'm not sure if you can hear, but my husband is out in the living room playing with the baby. It's the most adorable thing. I love seeing the way she smiles at him. Ah, so in love with both of them. It's cute. Okay. Um, does this need a title? No. I've been using this for dinners, but I think... Let me see. Yes, I will use this side for dinners. This box has kind of changed every single week that I've used this insert. I'm still trying to kind of stretch out and figure out how I want to use it. Um, I think I'm going to assume that the dates carry over and I'm going to put baby care because this week is a slightly different week as far as who's taking care of the baby on each day. And so I'm just going to fill that out. Let's see. I don't know why I'm right me. I know who I am. There we go. Uh, I'm trying to remember, yes. This is what I mean about the boring stuff um, because I can't really talk and write and think all at the same time. Um, let's see, I think I don't need these boxes on the side, so I'm just going to toss in some more washi tape for decoration. Okay, there we go. And it's a little. It's tricky to get this, uh, I want to say, no, is that 1.5 millimeter washi? Or is it thicker than that? It looks thicker than that. Very super skinny washi. This is from Night Owl Washi. Sorry, I didn't mention. Um, it's tricky to get it to stick because it has so little surface area. So if you stick the very tip, there's not that much in the very tip, you know, if that makes sense. All right. Um, ah, this. What was I going to do here? I think what I'm going to do here is I'm going to put a mini month. Yeah. I'm just going to do that. Um, make sure I get this right because it starts out on Monday. Here we go. Because I don't need the tracker here because as you will have seen in my plan with me video for the month. I'm doing a monthly tracker this month. So I don't need a weekly tracker. That would just be confusing. And I've seen people do their little mini month thing where they highlight the current week and that's fine. Let's see. I'm trying to make sure I don't miss numbers as I'm counting and talking at the same time. As I go through my months, by the way, talking and thinking and whatever at the same time, I just always make sure that at least every week, 7, 14, 21, 28 lines up. <laughs> that way, at least if I catch it, I only have to redo a week. This is a Pigma Micron 01. Um, I have not used these in a long time, but I pulled them out recently. All oh, right. You know what? I'm going to just forget that uh, the fact that there's no 31 on my calendar because really it doesn't matter. We are not at that point. We are barely even looking ahead to Christmas yet, which honestly should be more, but I like the week like that. Beautiful. So we know what day of uh, where we are in the month. Okay, and then it still says daily tracker. I'm 
thinking this might smudge really bad. Oh no, I'm not gonna use that color. Do I have? I am. I'm wondering if I just sort of write over it if I'll even notice. I don't remember. There were some ideas that I had for what to put there. Are they still in my brain dump? Mm. No, they're not. They never were. So, um, check my Instagram. I will try to remember to post on there when I decide what to put here. And then I'll be uh, marking off diapers on this side and then I need to actually fill it with stuff. I'll go ahead and put a header on the to-do column. As I'm in sort of in the process of wiggling around my planner system a little bit, um, I end up with more to-do lists that I'm working off every week than usual. Like I have this one here. I'm not going to take anything from here and put it here. I just kind of put a dot when I want to work on it. Um, mostly I just need to take things from my monthly. So, let's see. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, I need to remember I'm watering the tree. Every other day I need to water the tree on Tuesday. Thursday. We just got a new tree. You can get a tree from the city because we have municipal utilities. And so it's basically the power company gives us the tree uh, for shade because <clears throat> we have a south facing backyard. And All right, if you guys don't watch The Marvelous Mrs. Maisel, my plan basically is to binge season two when it releases on Wednesday. Um, it's a good show. And then we're going to a concert. That's why my parents are coming. And then I think we have, uh, I need to change what's on my uh, monthly because it just changed today. But we are, let's see, we're going to be heading out of town just for the weekend. We need to go visit some family for a quick, quick little visit. It should be nice. We went out of town for Thanksgiving. I, I considered filming a vlog, but did not. Um, we went out of town for Thanksgiving, took the baby. I did vlog the first time I left overnight with her, and I mentioned there it didn't go well overnight, the sleeping stuff. But since then, and that was like a couple months ago, right? Since then, we've done some sleep training, and she was amazing this last time. I was just so, so proud of her. She was just napping like a pro. And um, yeah, it was just, just really, really great. All right, then we've got to get to mass because it's a holy day of obligation on Saturday. Don't forget, we're Catholic friends. Uh, okay, then, yeah, I'm gonna put that here. I need to find some new people to join me in the podcast I do for my Hogwarts. It's going to be uh, week one of the new year. All right. I have some bills to pay. <coughs> okay, that's it there. And then, like I said, I'm not touching this. I'm going to do a video on this, um, just like a whole video on this piece of paper. So look forward to that. Uh, this is my, my Hogwarts list, and I want to make sure I don't miss anything. So let's see, post lesson for the new year. Man, time moves super fast when a year is only 10 weeks and you're not a student anymore. Okay, I don't have to grade homework yet. There we go. 
it may be time for me to redo this uh, list soon because it's one of the ones that I erased the check mark. I don't know if you can kind of see, it's a little bit ghosty. Um, these friction pens, they do great, but if you erase the same spot over and over again, they get a little bit messy. So every year I just, you know, like I've erased the first few weeks of the year so as we start the new one and there's a lot of ghosting. So basically this is one place that I moved to my weekly. That's on the other sheet. Um, I'm going to talk about this page in my flip through, which is coming up. And, oh yeah, I need to. Do this thing. And this is pretty much what my weekly setup looks like. Is just kind of looking at my monthly, looking at, you know, flipping through from front to back ish and just sort of putting things on a list of things I'd like to get done. Um, and since I moved to this, which we are in stages getting to, um, I've been doing a lot more of the things that I actually put here are the things that I'm definitely going to be able to get done. No idea what's for dinner. Um, yeah, no idea. So I'm going to leave that. And yeah. So subscribe to my, or fo follow me on Instagram at Gunchy underscore. If you want to find out what I ended up deciding to do with this, um, I will not be able to stand getting to the end of the week with it's, with it's still saying daily tracker for no reason. Um, so I might just stick a sticker there. You know what? I might just stick a sticker there. What do I have? Wonder. This is washi tape from, is that like super, I could trim it. Maybe. This came free with my Simply Gilded order. Um, and it's cute. It has nothing to do with stars. Oh, look, it's a candy cane. Candy cane teddy bear? Or, I mean, panda bear? Sure. Let's put a candy cane panda bear because it's December and you do that sort of thing. Well, that kind of, kind of, kind of. A pair of scissors handy. I don't. I will rip it. There we go. I am really becoming a fan of white washi tape um, because you can just kind of tear it where you need to and you kind of don't really notice it too much. It's a little bit like kind of scrappy but cute. And basically you just treat them like stickers. You just tear them up. That's what I've been doing with this um, emoji washi. Let me see if I've got some of those. Yeah, see like this. You can just put a little emoji on something without having to learn how to draw, which I don't know how to draw, so. Okay, uh, that looks like a week, guys. It's beautiful. Thank you for watching. I appreciate your time and attention, and I hope you guys have a fantastic week, and I will see you in the next video tomorrow, so don't forget to subscribe. I think I've already said that, and have a good one. Bye.